ha 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 what it is what it do with y'all man it's your man mr choker is back once again baby and today's video is another playoff predictions video man did, did y'all see did y'all see those games this weekend man they were crazy they were good they were funny they were heartbreaking i ain't gonna hold you guys man I enjoyed every single one of them this weekend. I hope y'all did too, man. Check this out, man. Things have changed. Man, oh man, things have changed. See, last week in my playoff prediction video, I had the Ravens beating the Bills. Some way, somehow, I thought it was going to be a rematch between Lamar and that man over there. In Kansas City, man. You know what I'm saying? My homeboy is what some people call him. I really thought it was going to be a rematch between those two, but apparently it's not going to be one of those to this year. But it's still going to be a great match between the Chiefs and the Bills if, if Patrick Mahomes gets to play. Because if y'all watched the game earlier, Patty Mahomes. Left the game in the third quarter with a concussion. And he did not return. They had that man, Chad Henney, in the game. Holding it down. Doing his part. You know what I'm saying? Pulling his weight and the team on his back to clutch the victory for them boys today, man. I'm not going to lie. I really, I wanted the Browns to win just because... Patrick Mahomes wasn't in the game, even though that would have been cool, you know what I'm saying? They, they would have been, you know what I'm saying? The world would have been like, yeah, they, they won the one if Patty Mahomes didn't get hurt, which would have been true. But they didn't win because that man, Andy Reid, is a goon. He's a goblin. He is a freaking maestro at being a head coach in the, oh my gosh, man. The fact that on fourth and inches, he calls a passing play to the flats to Tyreek Hill with a backup quarterback in the game, bro. With the game on the line, with this being the game, this this being the play of the game. The fact that he really had the the cojones to do that. I ain't gonna front, man. Andy Reid is definitely in my top three, top two coaches of all time, bro. Like seriously, man. But it is what it is, man. You know what I'm saying? The Browns didn't win. The Chiefs did win. Those Bills handled... <laughs> Those Bills did what they had to do against the Ravens, man. I ain't gonna lie. I seen, I seen a tweet on Twitter, man. Somebody said <laughs> the Ravens went all the way to Buffalo just to kick a field goal, <laughs> which is unfortunate. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to my Ravens fans out there. It's not meant to be this year. Hopefully, y'all come back next year, man, and, um, you know what I'm saying, put a little bit of work in, maybe definitely get to the AFC Championship. But as for the NFC, which is where it really matters, man, the Packers handled the Rams like I thought they were going to. It was it was somewhat of a close game until the end. Not going to lie to you. It was a close game until the end, but the Packers did what they were supposed to do. Aaron Rodgers did what he was supposed to do. Aaron Jones did what he was supposed to do. Those, those other two running backs did what they were supposed to do. They got the dub. Simple. Now, them boys is going to the NFC Championship. But they got to play against a team that probably just put Drew Brees on retirement. The Tampa Bay Buccaneers. They did what they had to do, baby. And they got that dub. Like I said, they were going to, man. Just beat the Saints 30 to 20. It was a hell of a game, man. It was such a defensive game. You couldn't help but love it. You did not want that. That was the kind of game I promise you guys, man. Other than Michael Thomas pretty much not being involved in the Saints offense, that was the kind of game where you definitely enjoyed both sides. And everything they brought to the table, man. It was just an incredible ball game. Like, it really was. And man, oh man. That man, Tom Brady. He's that. Mama, there goes that man. 
He did. Hey, look, no interception, no turnovers by the Buccaneers, man. No turnovers. That's all. That's all it took. No turnovers. Unfortunately, Drew Brees threw three interceptions, which you know, what I'm saying one of them probably was his fault. But I feel like the other two were his wide receivers' fault. But it is what it is, man. It, it's over and done. With. It didn't happen. You know what I'm saying? Buccaneers got that dub, and they will, they will be going to play against the Packers in the NFC Championship. Now, now, this is where it gets crazy. Who do I think is going to win in the AFC side, the Chiefs versus the Bills? <sighs> if y'all watched my last video, you know who I picked. The Chiefs. I picked the Chiefs to win against the Ravens, but the Ravens aren't there this time. It's the Bills. I'm going to say this. Disclaimer. If Patrick Mahomes doesn't play, the Bills are going to win. Plain and simple. The Bills are going to win if Patrick Mahomes is not able to play. If he is, the Chiefs are going to win easily. It's going to be a good game. I feel like it's going to be a real good game. But I feel like Patrick Mahomes and them are still going to run away with it. They, they would have ran away with it tonight. They really would have. But he got hurt. Patrick Mahomes got hurt. Gave them, gave them Browns a chance. Made it a close game. Closer than what it should have been, honestly. But, hey, it is what it is. Like I said, if he plays next week, he's going. They're going to win. They're going to win. They're going to the Super Bowl. Now, on the NFC side, man, y'all already know who I'm rooting for. Y'all already know who I'm Bucks, man. Bucks. Tom Brady is going to the Super Bowl again. And he's going to win the Super Bowl. I'm saying it right now. The Bucks will be champs. Simple. That's it, man. That's it. That's it. I'm going to catch you guys next week. We're going to talk more about these predictions. We're going to talk about who's going to be in the Super Bowl. I know. I know that my predictions are going to come true. Watch what I tell you in the next. Watch what I tell you in the next playoff prediction video. All right. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video, man. If you did, smash that like button down below. Hit that subscribe button if you're new. And come back tomorrow for the next video. Peace.